morning guys uh, something a bit different today quick bit of history and explanation of the title I'm sure some of you that are as old as me remember the hurricane in 87 well out in the location where I am today I'm not saying there was a, a farm farming wild boar and during the hurricane this area was hit quite hard a lot of trees come down as we know and it ruined the stock fencing and the pens they were kept in and they all buggered off they've a lot of them have moved into this particular bit of woodland i'm going to try and film them or take photos of them it's the wrong time of day really so how much success I don't know but at best I'll get them on film at worst I'll have a nice walk we'll see how it goes catch in a bit it's a nice location this and it's fairly quiet apart from the motorcycles up the main road you can just bet here in the distance not many people in here I'm going to scout round and most likely is over that area opposite side of that that stream I'll wander around a bit further and see if we can at least find some sign as you can probably see here something's been scraping around the roots underneath this tree which is quite a classic sign because there's no other disturbance nearby so we might be on the right track I'll carry on up through here see what I can find Well, I've picked up their trail, uh, plenty of sign, but no actual sighting. You can probably see, get my finger in the shot, make out their game trail there. Now they travel through this way. The direction I've come from is down by the stream. Obviously, they need a water source. Um, I've found tracks crossing the main access road in here and I've just followed that track and this is obviously the direction they go so I'm thinking what I need to do is actually set up in here overnight one night uh, some nice spots actually get the hammock in here nice and quiet up off the ground should be to see plenty well in theory so uh, yeah bit disappointing I haven't spotted but like I said at the beginning at least I've had a, a nice walk round seen the sign that they're still in here not bad Ooh, what's he jumping up and down that tree I was often getting on film. Don't know what that is. I'm not really into birds. I'm sure someone will tell me. Won't you mow? Um yeah, nice spot. Definitely going to have to come back here. Now, I just had to share this with you. When I'm out in the woods, I'm normally creeping about quiet. There's not many things 
that make me laugh out loud. I mean properly laugh out loud. Came up a track. Smallest dense bit here. Thought I'd check it out. As I was approaching it, I hear a low sort of grunt, rumble. Thought, hey, up. Might have found them. So I squatted down quiet. Couldn't hear any movement. And then after a, about a minute, there it was again. It was my bloody stomach. For God's sake. What amateur. <laughs> oh, still, made me laugh. See ya. Right, I'm walking back out. Had a good morning. Had a nice walk. Spotted some nice locations for the future, shall we say. It's uh, been a good morning. Didn't see the wild boar, which is disappointing, but I didn't really expect to. It's the wrong time of day. It's mid-morning now. Really, it's you know, first light, last light. Sort of thing. Uh, but hey, sometimes you're lucky, sometimes you aren't. But uh, all in all, it was a good walk. Nearly back to the car. I've been round. Up there, up to the road. Yes. Another one to return to. It's it's a great part of the world where I am, where I live. But in some ways, it almost has a bit of a negative. There is so many places to go. I not decide I want to do a camp. I look at the map and think, oh, which one? And as soon as I go somewhere and set up, I've got myself all comfy, I think, should have gone to that one instead. Never mind. Better than having none, isn't it? Never mind. Ooh, squelch, squelch. Ooh. Right, that's me. Enough of my waffling. See you all soon. Ooh. Ooh, look. Big thumb. See you soon. Bye. Right, I'm back to the car on the ultra busy road, as you can see. And sometime I'll have to go that side of the road because there's a lot there too. I was in in Hia. Uh, I think it's about 150 hectares, something like that. So easy enough to get lost in there for a, a little while without anyone finding you. But there's just as much that side. <sighs> decisions, decisions.